Hey, howdy, hey, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. Um, for today's video, we're gonna go over the recently posted uh, trailer for season 14 premieres, the season 14 premiere. So if that sounds good to you, make sure to hit that like button, comment down below, and hit that subscribe button, come join the Sam and Hour community if you haven't already. And without further ado, let's get this video started. <laughs> Alright, alright, so, um, obviously today is Thursday, tomorrow we have our Drag Race Season 14 premiere, and I am so excited for the season to start, um, I am going to be going over the trailer that was released for Episode 1, so, hey, if you haven't checked it out, I'll put a link down below for it, but I figured I would go over all the outfits, talk to you guys about what I'm expecting from this episode, and sort of what I'm expecting overall from the season moving forward. Um, just have a fun little conversation with you guys about Drag Race, obviously. I also do want to mention I will be doing a YouTube Live tomorrow night before the episode premieres. Uh, probably around 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And that would be 4 p.m. Pacific Ti Standard Time. And all the above. So I figured that'd be a fun little YouTube Live we could do before the premiere. And I will be doing YouTube Lives every Friday before their episodes air. Um, just so we can talk about Drag Race and all the things Drag Race. And then obviously, also, I do want to put, put out that my review for episode 1 will be posted Friday night, hopefully. Ho my goal is to get it out pretty quickly after the episode airs. Um, so definitely be on the lookout for that. Make sure you're subscribing and doing all the things. So, with that all out, out of the way, we're going to go over this <laughs> intro part of the premiere and all the above. Um... So let's get into it. Obviously, this episode is going to start out with introducing all of the queens. So, all seven queens that we're getting in this premiere. Because it is a split premiere. So, from the first premiere, these are all the queens we will be getting to see. First, walking into the workroom, we have Alyssa Hunter from Puerto Rico. Um, I will say, I'm very excited to have a Puerto Rican queen. We have not had a queen from Puerto Rico I believe since season 8 or 9, um, I'm pretty sure uh, Cynthia Lee Fontaine was the last Puerto Rican queen, so I'm super excited to get another Puerto Rican queen on the show, I think that's awesome. Well, queen born in Puerto Rico. Anyways, um, yeah, I'm super excited for Alyssa Hunter. I will say I'm not crazy about her outfit, it's not bad, but I don't, it's not bad, I like it, it's just it's not my favorite. Like, it, it's fine, it's fine. It's a good for it's good for an entrance into the workroom. It works. Uh, next, walking into the workroom, we have Bosco from Seattle. Bosco is definitely giving some cool vibes, cool energy. I'm really excited by Bosco. I think they have a very unique um, perspective in drag. I think that's super exciting. Um, the outfit's really cool. I like the whole polka dots all around, the um, cohesive, cohesiveness of it all, the devil aspect is fun, um, definitely showing right from the start the, what their aesthetic is, how they represent in their drag, um, all the above, very much giving me alternative drag-esque style, which is really exciting. Um, Bosco, I'm really excited for, they're from Seattle, um, yeah, I think they're gonna be a fun queen to watch this season. Next, we have Cornbread the Snack Jeté. Oh, when she walks in, oh my god, Cornbread is the moment. I am obsessed with Cornbread already. I think she's hilarious. I think she's such a fun personality to have on the show. I think she's going to really be the focus of the season because Cornbread... Oh, I'm excited for some cornbread. I'm really excited for cornbread. She's amazing. She's from L.A. I love that she's very much like, yes, I'm from L.A. I'm here to represent. I think that's awesome. I'm really excited for cornbread. I, I hope she does really well this season. I'm sure she will. But I, I love cornbread. Next, we get Willow Pill from Denver, who now I believe in, lives in Chicago. Um, I like this outfit. I like that she misspelled Angel. I think that's really cute. How it says Angle. I think that's a fun detail. Um, Willow is actually Evie Oddly's drag sister or drag daughter. Some sort of relation with Evie Oddly. Um, they also do say that they've 
basically gone a year without doing drag because of uh, the Pernini Press. So of course this is their jump back into drag. So that's a really big jump back into drag, obviously. Um, Willow gives me some nervous energy and I'm worried for that. But I am really excited for Willow Pill. I think they bring something really unique to their drag, which I'm super excited to see on the show. Um, I think they're a fun personality, and I think they'll do well. Hopefully they can shake off the nerves. Obviously walking into the workroom is a very big moment, so I'm sure that's part of it. Um, but I'm still super excited to see Willow Pill and what they can do on this show. So, work. Uh, next we get, um, Carrie Colby. Bitch. <laughs> Carrie Colby is the moment. She's stunning. Stunning, stunning, stunning. Best outfit out of all the workroom entrance outfits, if I'm being real. Stunning. Her face, her mug, her look, her wig, every single detail. I am obsessed with Carrie Colby. She's stunning. Um, even with, like, the music playing when she walks into the workroom, like, you can tell they, they wanted you to focus on her beauty. And she is gorgeous. Also, obviously, from the legendary house of Colby. So I'm super excited to see what Carrie Colby will bring for the show. I'm Carrie Colby is very much giving me front runner energy with the entrance, just gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. And yeah, I'm super excited for Carrie Colby. Up next, we June Jambalaya. All right, I'm gonna be real here. Not crazy about this outfit. I like June. I like June a lot. Not crazy about this outfit. I feel like they could have done something much better, if I'm being real. I don't know what it is. I don't like the top. I don't like the shoes. I like the wig. I like her mug. Her mug is good. I just wish the outfit was different. I'm sorry. I, I feel bad saying that. I just, I think this was my least favorite outfit from the entrance looks that we've gotten this premiere. Um, I, I like June a lot. I just not crazy about this outfit at all. I, Giving my real tea here. Like, it's not bad. It's just... It's not good. Yeah. I'll, I'll say that. Again, no hate to June Jambalai. I'm super excited to see what they will bring on the show. Finally, we get Orion Story from Grand Rapids, Michigan. And she will let you know that she is from Michigan. Um, I'm, I like uh, Orion, I will say. I really like this outfit. Um, I like what they're bringing to the show. They seem fun. Um, I will say... I've been excited by other queens, more so excited by other queens, but I'm still excited for Orion. I'm sure they're going to do great things. Yeah, I'm excited. Um, also for the premiere, the guest judge is going to be Lizzo. Of course, I am obsessed with Lizzo. I love Lizzo, so I'm really excited to see her be a judge. Um, obviously, she's been a judge already, but, like, I love Lizzo, so, like, I'm excited. I would love to have Lizzo as a guest judge from, like, if I were on the show on my premiere, like, think about it, work. Alright, um, and right off the bat, they do announce that the mini challenge, the first mini challenge of the season is going to be a photo shoot, so we are going back to the photo shoot mini challenges on the premieres, which I'm so happy for. Like, I love the photo shoot challenges. I think they're a great first mini challenge. I love watching them. I think it's great way, a great way for all the queens to introduce themselves. I... I love it. I love that we're going back to that. I think that a lot of people have been asking for this, and I'm really happy they're doing this for the premiere. I think that's a great choice, so I'm excited. I don't think we've had a photo shoot mini challenge since season 8. Yeah, since season 8. That's crazy. So I'm super excited for this one. Alright, so that's the first premiere. That's all I got so far from the trailer. I'm super excited to review it for you guys tomorrow. Um, I will be watching it and then reviewing it, and obviously doing the live beforehand, so make sure you tune in for that. Um, but I do want to go over all the queens we will get to see on the second premiere, and who the guest judge is going to be, and all the above. So for the second premiere, we are getting Diabetti, Deja Sky, Angeria Paris Van Michaels, Maddie Morphosis, Lady Camden, Georges, Georges, I love that name. And Jasmine Kennedy. Jasmine Kennedy. Jasmine Kennedy. Jasmine Kennedy. I'm really excited for all of these queens to be introduced as well, obviously. Um, I'm excited to see how they do competing in their own mini challenges and their own things, all the above. I'm excited to see them all meet and all the above. Also, there is one thing I did forget. 
RuPaul did announce that this week someone will be eliminated. So each from I assume from each of the groups someone's getting eliminated. So like right from the bat we're going in, which I'm excited for. Very much giving me season six energy. So I'm excited for that. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. And also for the second premiere, the pr get judge is going to be Alicia Keys, which is really cool. I'm excited to see Alicia Keys. I'm excited to see what happens next week and this week and all the above. And I'm just overall excited for season 14. I think it's going to be a really fun season. I'm excited to see all these queens compete and get to know all of them. So, that does bring me under my quick little review of the trailer and all the above. Let me know what you think about all this down below in the comment section. Make sure to like this video if you liked it. Share it all over social media. And hit that subscribe button. Come join the Sam and Hour community. And I will be live tomorrow at 7pm Eastern Standard Time. Make sure to tune in for that. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok at Sam and Hour. And I will be back here tomorrow with my live and all the above. Alright, I'll see you later. Bye!